Uh, let's uh, let's make you a corn dog. Here we go. Let's go vertical on that and uh, go ahead and spread some paint. Get it started here. Okay, here we go. Get a nice little uh, little atmospheric quality of sorts. All right, so let's uh, see what we can do here with the corn dog. Let me get a smaller, do I have a smaller brush or is that my only brush? I guess this is, oh, here's the brush I was looking for. Oh, it's on the ground. Okay. Let's get a corn dog here. Here we go. I'm going to go red first. And then we'll put the stick on there. Get a stick for you. There you go. Now let's put some highlights on that. It's it's not really a red corn dog, is it? It's more. Uh, it's got more of the yellow ochre on there, but uh, it's okay to have uh, some of the red show through, you know. Okay. All right. Uh, there there it is. A, a corn dog. For you here. All right, uh, thanks again for coming on in here. Welcome to Fast Food Paintings. We had our grand opening a couple of days ago. Uh, we we're still working out some of our kinks, or so changing some of the menu uh, around. Uh, paint a hot wing burrito. A hot wing burrito. Now, what what would be a hot wing burrito? I'm trying to figure out what that would be. I mean, it'd be more like a burrito, no? I mean, would it be you couldn't see nothing inside, unless you want the hot wings on the side next to the burrito. Okay, well, okay, we'll do a burrito with the wings up to the side uh, on fire. We'll put some flames on there. How about that? Okay, let's do that. Sounds good. So let's get ahead, get started here. Uh, Hey, get this going here. Here we go. This kind of uh, get some paint on the canvas. Uh, kind of a standard move. Uh, don't even have to think about it. That's that's why I like that process, that uh, initial response. And uh, if we can clean our brush off here just a little bit. All right, let's make a burrito. Here's our burrito, and uh, we can always fine tune it, uh, we can always fix it as we go along here. So that's just sort of initially that's the burrito. Now let's get some wings, some chicken wings, uh, maybe uh, put a couple of chicken wings on top. Okay, and then they're on fire. <laughs> on fire baby let's get some yellow on there on the fire the flames we need some fresh yellow let's get some more yellow Fresh, uh, fresh yellow. We got some red. We need some more yellow ochre. Let's get some more yellow ochre. Okay. There you go. All right, and then uh, let's work that burrito a little bit if we can. Get the wrapping going on on the burrito, sort of burrito wrapping. Let's give some uh, shadow to the wings, give them the wings a little bit of a shadow effect. 
some little ligament stuff. And uh, let's go ahead and uh, get some little bit of last bit of choice bits. Maybe a little shadow on that, uh, I guess. I, I don't know, on the burrito. Maybe a uh, floor. No, I don't really want the floor. Let me get rid of the floor. Or, or I have the floor. I don't know. One of those things. Maybe, it, maybe some highlights. Let me get back onto that burrito. All right, uh, here you go, a burrito. Hot wings, hot wing burrito. The fast food paintings. May I take your order? May I take your order? A lot of people don't know quite what this is going on. What is what is fast food paintings? It's a good question. Good question indeed. I'll tell you what it is. Paintings of fast food at fast food prices. You just came in to the vortex of how simple and beautiful that is. Anyway, uh, we got hamburgers, fries, shakes, onion rings. Uh, we're taking your calls, 818-528-4516. You want to talk about hamburgers, french fries, shakes, you want to order a painting of such, give us a call, 818-528-4516. All right, uh, let's get back to uh, our painting here, and uh, let's see if there's another order coming in. Uh, in the, okay, no, no more orders. Okay, so let's, uh, we got the one order here. Uh, take them as they come, as they say, here. Uh, let's get some paint. Uh, again, just put some paint down here. All right. Oh, a little too much. A little too much. All right. So let's wipe that down here. And, and uh, move it along. Move the paint along here. Okay. Uh, get, a, get a little background action, as, as we, uh, we like to talk about quite a bit. Uh, get, get some activity uh, going. Okay. So let's go ahead and, and start off with, uh, you know, I had been making... Without, I do the clown usually last, but let's let's do the clown first, or at least part of the clown. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead and do that. Get it going here, and of course clowns have big shoes, so let's put some big shoes in here. Boom, big old shoes. Boom, and then uh, more more uh, get some uh, pants on there. And uh, usually a sad face, so let's get them a sad face. Maybe go smaller with the brush if we can. All right. Give them some hair. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, some eyes and uh, some uh, a little button of sorts there. Okay, now let's get over to the burger, uh, make the burger, uh, the value meal, uh, or the fun club meal, that is. Let's get the burger going on here. Here we go. A nice little, uh, a, a, just a nice, a, you want some cheese on that there, uh, Matt? Let's go ahead and uh, put some cheese on that, if, if you don't mind. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and put that on there. Uh, you didn't tell me one way or the other, you know what I mean? So uh, I guess we'll be all right if I just went ahead. That's not what you ordered? Uh, okay, so I'll, I'll, I'll take the cheese off. We'll, we'll leave the cheese off. But I'll put some lettuce in there, all right? Let me give you some lettuce and tomato. That comes with it. 
because in the fun club we are trying to uh, include more veggies in our fun clubs and so you know it, it's, it's not a bad idea to uh, leave out the cheese since it's sort of a double protein unnecessary kind of thing but uh, but it's really important to get those veggies in so that's why we put we always make sure we put the lettuce and the tomato in that fun club burger all right let's get some fries off to the side there okay and of course fries are a vegetable and of course you know that also ketchup is a vegetable and uh, that's what uh, Ronald Reagan uh, said uh, many years ago when he was the governor of California and uh, that's true it, it is true he was right uh, because everything that uh, Ronald Reagan uh, said was uh, correct okay so let's get another uh, get that coke uh, cup going on there yeah, a little straw for you there you go uh, let's get some highlights shadows on the burgers if we can uh, uh, and, and as some little sesame seeds on the burger bun I guess huh? maybe some shadow on the burgers itself there there you go looking slightly uh, like a like a fun club value mail should you know uh, uh, delicious D delicious is what the, what we're looking for and uh, we want to make this a, a fun thing and I think that's exactly what we are what we're offering here for you at uh, fast food paintings uh, quality quality artwork at fast food prices all right uh, here's your uh, fun club meal with clown All right, uh, these are. Uh, this is a special price uh, with uh, because of the uh, the clown. It's a. Uh, it's a, a, They're twenty dollars. Uh, if you want to PayPal me twenty dollars, uh, Matt, uh, that'd be great. I'll send it off to you. Shipping uh, included. All right, uh, give us a call 818-528-4516. Uh, uh, make your orders. Bring your orders in. We, we are uh, here here for you here for you to provide quality service at, uh, at, at affordable prices. Talking about burgers, onion rings, french fries, Till we die, till we die. We're just gonna keep talking forever. Don't give up, guys. Whatever, whatever idea you have, by the way, uh, don't uh, don't give up. Don't don't uh, don't worry about the uh, the ignorance, the <laughs> the systematic uh, indifference from from others uh, towards uh, your uh, excitement, your. deliverance don't let that stop you so if you want to have a fast set up your own fast food restaurant so be it I, I like that I like that idea humble wick that is true it's it, these the, this is better than buying gold I, I think so too I was talking about how you know we, we sort of uh, because we set the prices at fast food prices, uh, there, there, there's no doubt that they will actually go up in value. And uh, you know that's that's not something you could be said when you buy a say a hamburger, uh, an actual physical hamburger. Uh, a hamburger, as you know, will decay. Uh, though actually, no. Uh, fast food hamburgers are famous for not doing anything but just uh, having a long shelf life. But basically, they, they're pretty bad uh, at at uh, right after uh, they've been made. Uh, they, they don't last very well in terms of taste. Uh, but in terms of taste, in terms of, you know, it could be bad taste. Uh, someone someone who who might think uh, 
you know, uh, a painting, uh, a fast food painting uh, by Mr. Let's Paint uh, could be in bad taste. But that's that's a that's a uh, an etiquette. That's a, a a jurisdiction, a prudence jurisdiction of, of the personal uh, elk that uh, comes from uh, your own understanding of what you like. So it's a, it's a it's a it's a, a decision uh, of taste, but but not an actual physical taste that you eat. It's a it's a taste of of uh, well that's it's a play on word, isn't it? Taste. <laughs> All right, so well, and those—that's something you have to grapple with. Uh, but uh, that is, you know, something that we don't worry about. Uh, we just keep going. We keep going. We keep making paintings uh, for you, paintings of fast food for you. And of course, we're taking your orders. Eight one eight five two eight four five one six. Or if you if you're in the chat room, give us a uh, uh, ring, uh, ring a ling, and uh, let me know what your uh, what would you like to buy. Uh, Hamburgers, uh, you know, no one's really been ordering the double bacon cheeseburger, and uh, that, uh, my friends, is uh, pretty uh, pretty awesome. Let me uh, let me show you some of the other wonderful products uh, on our menu. Uh, again, we do take special orders, uh, but uh, just just so that you guys haven't, uh, just so you know, just so you know, some of the other wonderful products that we have for you here. Uh, the, the fries, now that, uh, that's, that's quite the deal, the fries and the onion rings. Uh, and that is the, uh, uh, that is the, the, the double cheeseburger. The double cheeseburger, and uh, that's the double, uh, the bacon double cheeseburger. And we like the double cheeseburger, it's fun to paint. Uh, and again, we like to put a lot of lettuce and uh, fun stuff in there uh, with that. And then, of course, that's a big burger uh, there. That's the big double bacon burger. Uh, we haven't really finished the rest of the menu out. We kind of, <laughs> we, we got so excited about providing you this service that we, we didn't really get to, uh, Putting the final f finishing touches here. Uh, believe it or not, we're this is our third day here at Fast Food Paintings, but it's going strong. We're having a good time and uh, providing you guys uh, quality quality artwork at uh, at really incredible prices. Uh, maybe maybe you might. Uh, I have a question. Uh, we, we do take questions uh, about uh, our ingredients. Some people have asked that. What, what, what kind of ingredients are we using for these paintings? Uh, let me just show you. Uh, we are using uh, top quality cardboard uh, that has been gessoed. So we, we uh, and, and they're roughly all about 8 by 10 inches. And uh, they've been gessoed uh, on one side. And then we're using professional uh, oil paint uh, from uh, predict uh, well uh, in our in, in some case uh, we have some Utrecht uh, oil paints and then the other paints that I use uh, predominantly are the classic artist oils and uh, they actually come in a caulking gun uh, and again they're they're all considered kind of uh, high quality paints uh, profession they're not uh, you know they're, they're considered professional paints. Uh, they're, they're probably not the, the very best uh, and they're clearly not the most expensive but there is something to be said about using quality ingredients uh, when, when you're cooking uh, either cooking or, or painting for that matter uh, in our case we're painting um, I, I know it's a little confusing uh, we're, we're, we're combining uh, food uh, vernaculars with, with uh, painting references uh, and it's all getting jambled up, but uh, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, the confusion uh, is uh, is fine. I, I I have no problem with that. I don't I don't I don't I don't, I don't care uh, to worry uh, about any uh, lack of clarity uh, coming from me myself, uh, or or uh, do I care about the fact that you know uh, one one is is not necessarily ready, uh, say for uh, you know anything more than than just doing what you do, uh, and, and that's all you can do is do what you do. Now, yeah, yeah, one could uh, try to better themselves uh, through through uh, various. Uh, op we, do we have an order? Uh, otherwise, I'll just keep talking.
which I guess I could. Uh, I do that anyway. <laughs> uh, but but you know uh, what what I offer uh, is myself. I offer myself to you, uh, and uh, uh, in a sense through these paintings, but also just by uh, providing you uh, a, uh, a a a, a live uh, interaction uh, uh, force field uh, of sorts. Uh, but but you know. There's a lot of talk. There's a lot of talk of, 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 of bettering yourself, bettering yourself, uh, and and I think we misconstrued uh, what that means uh, by uh, with the idea that uh, you know get more education. I'm not I'm not against edu education, uh, but I'm against uh, feeling that you one has to do a uh, uh, particular. Uh, path I'm against that I'm against that in 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 this in, in the sense that of what what creativity is all about um, th this isn't about uh, you know being on uh, entertainment tonight this isn't about uh, you know being part of the popular culture this isn't about rehearsed garbly gook I'm not singing the song and practicing the song for you. You know what I'm saying? This is straight from the heart. <laughs> straight from the heart. And I know it's a little hard to take. I know for, for a lot of you who, who want perfection in your lives, who seek it out, who try and want it and get it and want it in their artwork or in their lives, in their, in their fellow human beings, they seek that out. You're not going to get that from me. You're going to get me stumbling and bumbling. But I keep coming at you. As long as they don't pull the plug. Anyway, uh, welcome again to Fast Food Paintings. Uh, Mr. Let's Paint, this is my new restaurant. My new operation, my new enterprise. Come on in uh, and uh, order up yourself a lovely, tasty, Hamburger, French fries, great deal. The value meal, that's always good uh, because then you get a lot of little various things. And of course, the fun club with the clown is uh, really, uh, really kind of a, a, a neat one. We've, we've done three of those already. And of course, that was designed by Blyron uh, just yesterday uh, by our uh, talented designer, Blyron. And myself, a collaboration of sorts, and you know that's that's what we love is a collaboration, uh, uh, interaction, the interaction. We like that. At least I like it. I think. I mean, I, maybe I'm fooling myself. Maybe we are all fooling ourselves. Maybe we don't want to have anyone really interacting with. But you know what? You got to try it. Uh, and I think when it gets down to it. You're alive. You're alive by by doing just that. We are alive by uh, by the interaction. Uh, we are social, social human beings. We need need the interaction. I need it. I need it. And uh, may maybe you don't want to, uh, you don't have a need uh, as of yet for a for a painting of a hamburger. I, I understand that, but just keep in mind, it's pretty hard to hang a painting. Uh, well, it's hard. It's hard to display a hamburger, a painting. Uh, uh, well, not a painting, but but the actual physical hamburger. It's hard to do anything with that, uh, though. Uh, I suspect uh, it has been done, and it will continue to be done. Uh, the displaying of, of 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 hamburgers and French fries and onion rings, uh, and, and various food products that, uh, in a sculptural form, uh, that uh, will slowly decay. That that is entirely uh, uh, possible uh, and and uh, feasible. But but uh, but when it gets down to it, uh, you're you're gonna probably just get grossed out by it. 
you're gonna probably just throw it away. I, I, I suspect you'll probably just throw away that uh, burger and fries that have been uh, sitting there. Uh, you thought that was cool for a while, but then it, the intrinsic value, the value uh, lessened uh, when when it didn't feel like uh, you know when it just it just just didn't feel like it was gonna. It was just getting in the way, and, and you had to throw it away. So we we uh, most likely you, you you're not gonna want to do anything with that. But but here now a painting, a painting of a hamburger and fries. Now that that you can put on a wall, that you can cherish forever, forever. We'll be here. We'll be here uh, for as long as it takes to get that message across that paintings at fast food prices is where it's at. We're creating a A, <laughs> I don't know. What what are we creating? Uh, <laughs> a smorgasbord, a tidal wave. How about that? A tidal wave. A cornucopia. We're creating something. I don't know what it is, and that's the beauty. That is the beauty, uh, is entering uh, into uh, the unknown. And, and that's clearly what we're doing here. Uh, not many, uh, you know, I, I, I'm grateful, frankly, that, uh, that uh, the handful of you uh, uh, have ordered, and, and I'm, I'm actually uh, tickled pink uh, with that. Uh, and, and, but I, but I, we, we would want to see this... Uh, you know, we want to go a little further with it, but uh, I don't know. Uh, it might not, might not ever go much further than, than what it is. It might be just this is it. Uh, I'm okay with it for now, but I guess I will. Uh, uh, I guess I'm uh, actively, uh, in some ways, interested in in uh, providing uh, this uh, in a uh, more of a brick and mortar kind of operation. Uh, and uh, as I mentioned to Matt, uh, and, and really to anyone out there who might like to see this uh, in a in an opening uh, kind of uh, you know in a gallery space on an opening night type of way, uh, this this could be quite the uh, uh, the uh, cat's meow, as they say. You know, like one of those. Uh, you know, you might have a gallery. A, a Branson wants a cone. You you want an ice cream cone? Okay, uh, let's get you an ice cream cone. Uh, you know, like you know, there's first Fridays or first Thursdays of you know yeah you these big old galleries uh, where where everyone's got like 30 galleries within a couple of blocks of each other in in, in a particular town, and you know fast food paintings inside one of these galleries w uh, would be be uh, stupendous, stupendous. So we're looking for we're looking for places that may uh, be uh, of interest. Uh, and we got the burger shop. We also have the flower shop and the bakery. And uh, so, all right, uh, let's make you an ice cream cone, uh, Brad Branson, uh, uh, Bry Bryson. What one cone? Let's get you a cone here. Here we go. Got another order, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and put this up here on for you here. Okay, I uh, work that background in there. Okay, now what kind of ice cream do you want in that cone? Do you, you just want to want me to just make one for you for you, or do you want a a particular uh, type? Okay, so now I'm, I'm kind of uh, having some issues here. Uh, I tend to do this. I, I I make the background way too too dark or or too similar to, to the 
to the rest of the painting that I'm using. So let's just kind of, you know, the beauty of, of a brush, of a paper towel is, is amazing. Uh, it really uh, can do a lot of, uh, uh, it, does, it almost does the same amount of stuff that a, a brush can do. Okay, so let's go ahead. Do, do we have a... Blood red, blood red. Okay, a blood red ice cream cone. Okay, let's get that going on there. I'm going to give you... Uh, let's get the cone in there first. And, oh, you know, should we make it... Uh, I'm going to make it a one of those... Uh, do you want the waffle cone? I'm going to give you a waffle cone unless otherwise uh, requested. Okay, so there's the waffle cone. I'm going to put little crisscross stuff on that. Now let's get you some blood red here. Okay, one scoop. How many scoops? One scoop. I'll do one for now unless you want a second one. I could probably fit a second scoop in here. Now, Blood Red, I'm going to use a little bit of Alizarin Crimson mixed in with the uh, Cadmium Red Medium. And that, that's going to give me a nice uh, Blood Red on there. Two scoops. Okay, let's fit a, I'm going to fit another one in here, uh, right here. How about that? It's going to sort of melt, melt in. Oh, and, and, and the three-dimensional aspects, too, uh, is... Uh, making it work out quite well because of the, the top cone is sitting on top of the bottom. Uh, the, the, the top scoop is sitting on top of the bottom scoop. Okay. Now let's work the shade uh, and get the waffle crisscross stuff on the waffle part. Okay. And uh, let's put some shade on this side. Okay. And then do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Get a little waffle action there. Do 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 do. Okay, and then let's go a little more shadow on the side here. This side, give it a little more shadow. Okay, without a doubt. Okay, and uh, there, there you go. Let's give a little more of a point on that bottom of the cone. It, it didn't quite get pointy enough for us. So, uh, and sometimes you know. Do you like those waffle cones where they put the little bit of chocolate at the bottom of the cone? I like that part. Okay, and maybe maybe a little bit of highlight on the side too, on, on this side. Yeah, like just a little, you know, that, that might help. Okay, oh wait, and that's it, that's it. Okay, Th there it is, a two scoop blood red uh, ice cream cone for Bryson. Is that right, Bryson? Is that your name? Looking nice, hey, hey, hey. You want to see your painting again? Yes, Matt. Let's take a look at your painting uh, of uh, of the uh, the Fun Club clown. There we go. There you go.